you're not in the courtroom, but no. you are investigating crime. Well, yeah, it, it's um, about famous cases that people would be aware of. And you see it through the prism of the witnesses who were there, the families who were the victims um, of the crimes themselves. That's the thing. When a person's a victim of crime, very often it affects absolutely everybody in the family. And, of course, we hear from the cops who investigated it, in some instances, the lawyers too. And you get the entire journey from the moment that the crime took place right through the investigation and ultimately to the criminal trial. And we don't just deal with that, but the first show also deals with an instance of a really staggering and very unusual miscarriage of justice, a case of Victor Nealon on Friday at 8 o'clock. And we learn how, in the very rare circumstances where there's a forensic mistake, it can take years, in this case, two decades to resolve, and Mr Nealon still hasn't had any kind of justice. I've been doing a similar series, Killer Women, for ITV, yeah. right, where I do a similar thing with American murderesses. But what's really interesting, a lot of them appear relatively normal, and they just get called up for yeah. whatever reason, through Absolutely. circumstance, pe bad people and so on. But occasionally, I have interviewed people where I really thought, wow, you are just... Pure evil. It's very uh, rare, you, though. That's a, that, that? Do you know, Piers, that's a really good question. It's very rare to meet that. You know, as a barrister, I'm often asked what so-and-so was like, and I've mm. represented some people who are accused of very serious crimes, some of which, some of whom rather, have been in the news. And as you know, people who are presented as evil and mm. wicked are, are really just that. Mm. You know, you have to engage with them. You have to build a rapport. And uh, normally, people aren't just evil. They're enormously more complex than that. Don't you agree? See, I keep telling you. What? Do you <laughs> yeah. Um, That's the adjective you grappled for. <laughs> evil. Oh, uh, it's, it's lovely to see. It's a riveting series. I just want to say, I love this Thanks. stuff. You can't beat true crime. When's it on Eight Friday? Eight o'clock on Friday evening. And I genuinely, I'm, I'm enormously proud of it. I think it's yeah. a, a really good moment to see how crimes are investigated. To give voice, of course, to the victims' families.